Welcome to the podcast for 1776 Forward. We're the grassroots movement that's crowdsourcing activism for the cause of philosophical liberalism. Stand up. Speak out. Hi, I'm Robert Garmon, and I'm one of the participants in 1776 Forward. I'm coming to you from my family farm here in Dalian, China. If you can hear some fireworks going off in the background, that's because it happens to be Chinese New Year season here. And one of the wonderful traditions of Chinese New Year is that, unlike in the US, here at this time of year specifically, individuals are allowed to purchase and set off pretty significant fireworks. So it's one of my favorite parts of life in China at the Chinese New Year, not at other times of the year, but during this time. Uh, you can hear <clears throat> a lot of bottle rockets going off and firecrackers going off. In fact, if you can see on the ground, I don't know if you can see it or not, uh, there, there are uh, the, the remnants of firecrackers from a couple of nights ago. Uh, at night, during the Chinese New Year season, it's almost like the 4th of July in the U.S., except that instead of one centralized fireworks display, it's going off everywhere. Neighbors kind of compete with each other in a sort of friendly competition to see who has the best fireworks displays. It's, it's really quite amazing. I've lived in China now for almost 12 years, but I'm originally from the U.S and I graduated from the Objectivist Graduate Center of the Ayn Rand Institute, which was the first ever master's level program of instruction in Ayn Rand's philosophy. I've been studying Ayn Rand's ideas for longer than most people watching this have probably been alive. I started reading Ayn Rand in 1985 as a high school junior, you can guess how old I am based on that. Uh, and I quickly became engrossed in her philosophic ideas and eventually made it my life's career. I have a PhD in philosophy from the University of Texas. And I also have a bachelor's in political science and economics from the University of Chicago. So all three of these fields kind of form the background for my work today. I've lived in China now for about 12 years. I taught at a university, Dongbei University of Finance and Economics, for almost a decade. And during that time, I was able to teach business ethics. I taught Western civilization. I taught entrepreneurship. And I even got to teach a class called Moral Foundations of Capitalism, which is kind of an interesting choice given that I'm in the notionally communist country of China. It's not really communist, it's really closer to fascism, but that's a different story. Uh, at the time, there was a lot more academic freedom here than there is today, so I wouldn't be able to teach that class nowadays, I don't expect. Uh, at least I, I probably wouldn't attempt to do so anyway. But I was able to teach Ayn Rand's ideas, I taught Anthem to many, many years of, of students with uh, some very interesting results. And at that time, I was able to teach with a lot of academic freedom, arguably more than I would have had at an American university. As I say, things have changed a little bit and I wouldn't attempt to do that now. So I'll come on here occasionally to do a little video monologue of this sort. Unfortunately, at least at my home base in, in Dalian City, I don't get very good internet connections, so I won't be able to do a lot of interactive uh, discussions with the other participants in 70, 1776 Forward. But I will submit some monologues like this on topics mainly related to philosophy, economics, and politi political science, which are my main areas of specialization. Thanks for tuning in. 
If you'd like to join in the conversation, you can become a member for free and join our 1776 Forward community on Locals.com. See you there.